What's up, YouTube? So, the Miami Dolphins have just signed defensive tackle Neville Gallimore to a one-year deal. Um, I haven't been able to find exactly how much money he's going to be making with us. Uh, I don't imagine it's going to be a whole lot. In 2023, he really didn't, really didn't do a whole lot. Um, hasn't been massively productive um, in his time. But honestly, I also think the Dallas Cowboys have kind of used him incorrectly. When he was coming out of Oklahoma... He was more of like a slashy three tech. Like he he was pretty explosive, um, but was kind of raw. And needed to learn how to use his hands a little bit. But when Dallas drafted him, they drafted him because in their eyes he was the best player available in the third round. But they didn't need a three tech. They had a three tech. What they needed was a nose tackle. And when they drafted Neville Gallimore, they made him be a nose tackle. They had him put on weight like. When he was coming out of Oklahoma, he was like 6'2", like a little over 300 pounds, like 302 pounds, something like that. They had him put on some weight. You can definitely see that on film. Um, and they had him playing one. And that's just not his game. He's supposed to be like a slashing three-tech. That's really more his game. When he was coming out of Oklahoma, I, I seen him as like a slashing three-tech. Or if he could fix his hands, I could see him being like a 3-4 defensive end type of thing. At no point did I think he should have been a, a nose tackle. Which is what Dallas turned him into. Um, so yeah, he has been. He was kind of a disappointment with the Dallas Cowboys, but I also think he was just used incorrectly. I think if he can return to that athletic form, I think he can be a pretty good player because uh, he is athletic, he is bursty, um, he does have a good motor. He is a team first guy. Um, the fact that he was willing to put on weight and be a nose tackle just because that's what the Cowboys needed shows that fact. So, I mean, I, I mean, it's going to kind of depend on how much money he's making. I don't imagine it's a whole lot. I, I imagine it, it's going to be a pretty team-friendly deal because he hasn't done a whole lot in recent years. So, I mean, we'll see. Um, and also, he's fairly young as well. He's only 27, so there is that too. So, anyway, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, appreciate that like button. If you have any questions or comments, in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.